Pecky and I made it up for some drone footage this morning when the sun came up. Had a cold battery warning, so that was something that caught me a little bit off surprise, but um, you know, things that you're gonna learn. So now we're just enjoying a little morning fire for some coffee, probably. And then we get to try and pack up all of this stuff and head back down the mountain. Paco enjoyed his bed last night. Although he didn't use it as much as I thought he would, he still would, he'd still just get off the pad and go to the area off of it and then came back occasionally. So at least he had it and that's good. I know he wasn't gonna get too cold. So we'll get it dialed in. We're gonna need a bigger backpack though. We're gonna need a bigger backpack. All right, so. We're just going to do a couple fun things around camp and then get back on the trail. Better than no coffee. So we're just about done hiking. I'm go ahead and uh, wrap this up soon. Get back down the mountain, see the boys. It was a fun time. I think, uh, I think we'll do some more of this and I'll get better at it and with more experience. Sometimes we just don't value the process that it takes to get experience and expect everybody to be an expert at once, which is not fair. It takes time to learn things. All right, Pecco? Pecco, what are you chewing? I don't know why we spend money on chew toys. Nature is full of it. Ready to head down the mountain? Ready to pack up? You wanna go for a ride in the beep beep? We're just about packed up and ready to go. And we're gonna go ahead and head on down the mountain. We gotta kinda hurry, cause, well, there's not gonna be a lot of stopping and filming, unfortunately, cause we're gonna miss our rendezvous with the boys and Janine. So, we'll get a couple quick shots from camp and then we're gonna head on down the mountain.
So Petco and I are parking right along. And this has been a good choice for a trail. It's exactly a great way to get started with carrying all this extra stuff. Hardly any rocks. Sand, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So easy. Petco and I were up doing part of the AT a couple months ago, or maybe about a month ago. And there's a reason why it's called Rocksylvania. They're just everywhere, <laughs> everywhere. There's even one thing, it's not on the trail, but they have a landmark there called the uh, River of Rocks uh, by Cabela's in Hamburg. And it's, <laughs> this is, this is so, so nice. But at the same time, oh, man. I think my shoes might last a little longer on this trail. So I guess what I was saying about the George Washington and the road was moderately correct, although we will fact check that later on. Um, but yeah, that was probably one of the oldest mountain roads in America. If he was using this as um, a place to escape if you needed to, because Fort Valley is called Fort Valley for a reason. And when you start seeing campsites, your journey's almost at an end. Come on, Pecky, let's go. It's the thing about George Washington National Forest. There's so much great dispersed camping everywhere. It's free, first come, first serve, go for a hike. You got nature, fire rings. I couldn't believe it. I didn't grow up with stuff like that. Oh, and here we are, just at the end of our journey. So hopefully, Mama and the boys will be on in a little bit, and we'll be getting back together. <laughs>